Okay, hi, this is Steve from Ultraceps T-Shirt Color Separation Software. And today I am going to demonstrate to you a bug that began with Photoshop Creative Cloud and continues to Photoshop Creative Cloud 2017, well, which is the latest version as per the date this video was produced, um, that was not there with Photoshop CS6 and all versions prior to that. And that bug is uh, a problem with the color range function of Photoshop. Primarily the invert checkbox within uh, color range in Photoshop. It seems that starting with Photoshop Creative Cloud and all versions going forward, the invert checkbox within color range uh, is not responsive to any sort of external script or action to shut that invert box off, which I find very, very odd as just about all other user interface functionality within Photoshop is, respons uh, is responsive to plugins, JavaScript, and, uh, and uh, actions on the lower end. Now I'm going to um, give you an example of what that problem is and what that problem can cause. Now here we have a separation and um, we're going to pull a custom color channel from it. Now we're going to pull a flesh but um, even though Ultraceps did already pull a flesh we're just going to use it as an example. Now Ultraceps includes an action called custom color channel run. This is primarily used if your separation contains an odd color that uh, you know, the, the automated sequences of Ultraceps didn't pull. Maybe it's like a hot pink or something like that. So we're going to click color, uh, Custom Color Channel Run, follow the instructions, and within that instructions, Ultraceps told you to click the Invert button. Now this makes it easier for you to see your selection in the color range window. Now here, as I said, we're going to select uh, the flesh. And we'll move the fuzziness around, but this all doesn't matter. I'm just giving you an example. And, you know, we got a, an example here of uh, pretty much all the solid flesh selected. And we have the invert box checked. And we're going to click OK. And uh, Ultraceps pulled a channel called Spot Color 1, which is a flesh channel. If we double click it, you'll see it is flesh. But there's a problem that this created. Now, if we go up to... Um, select color range again you'll see that the invert box remains checked which is fine because we have functionality built into ultraceps that will shut that off now let me turn off button mode and we're going to go down to uh, an action that i've written which is incorporated into ultraceps that shuts that off and actually this action it's not possible to write it as an action it only selects the RGB channel. It does uh, a selection within color range and then deselects the selection. But the reason why it, uh, it can't be written as a action is because it contains a function called without invert. It's impossible to write an action with that function. Uh, it has to be done in XML and change and revert and changed uh, into an action file. Uh, but in any event. If I run this, it should turn off that invert checkbox. It does it in CS6, CS5.5, CS5.1, and everything prior to that. But for some reason, starting with Creative Cloud doesn't work. And let's uh, run that now. Now, we'll make sure our RGB channels are selected. I did run the action. As you can see, there's the three functions. We'll go up to Select, Color Range, and... For some reason, the invert checkbox is still checked. And this is going to create a big problem if you intend to run another fully automated separation after turning on that invert box. And I'll give you an example of that. Let's close this um, window here. And we are going to open up uh, the same file, but uh, without the color separation. Okay, and we are going to run, let's go back to button mode because most of uh, Ultraceps users are familiar with that. And we'll run Ultraceps sim process number three and let's see what happens 
with that invert box checked in color range. And look at that. The separation is a disaster. We have channels that are filled with solids, channels that aren't the correct color, channels that are appear inverted, channels with no information at all. And the reason why is because that invert box remained unchecked, uh, remained checked in color range. Now, although the automated color separations in any whatever type of color separation ultraseps does uh, with that whether it be simulated process true process index uh, grayscale whatever makes very little use of color range but the fact of the matter is even if it's only accessed once or twice and that invert checkbox remains checked that's going to have an impact on everything and the reason for that is that uh Ultraceps makes extensive use of what's called calculations and also the apply image function. So usually if you have one or two wrong bad channels such as inverted channels, it's going to affect all of the channels. Now, how are you going to fix this so you can continue to get to, back to doing separations correctly? Well, number one, you can restart Photoshop. Restarting Photoshop returns that uh, invert checkbox uh, in color range back to off, which is default. Or what you can do is you could reset it yourself. Now, to reset it yourself, you just need to select the RGB channel of any file. And let's go up to select color range and let's uncheck that invert box and make any selection at all. We don't have to be fussy because we're not really generating a channel. All we're doing is re resetting this invert box. Click OK and then deselect it. Now if we go to select color range, we'll see that the invert box is unchecked. Let's close this. Let's open that same file and run a separation again on it. And let's see if that fixed it. And we'll run the same separation Ultracept sim number three. And there you have it. The separation is perfect without any type of uh, any type of problem whatsoever. So if you do run any of these custom color channel uh, generation actions in Photoshop, whether it be this one or the one within the process color or the one to pull hard spot color, and then you do run an automated separation on another file after accessing one of these custom color channel functions of Ultraceps and you run into this separation that looks completely wrong, just remember to reset that color range invert checkbox to off or restart Photoshop. And uh, that's about it. That's all I got to say for today. I'll see you next time.